Hi there everyone, welcome to Technoholic. In this video, we're going to talk about how we can install CCleaner on your PC. CCleaner is a great tool for keeping your system running smoothly by cleaning out unnecessary files and optimizing your system setting. So CCleaner is more than just a cleaning tool. It's a comprehensive system optimization software that bring host of benefit to your PC. For example, removing temporary files file, optimizing your system performance, privacy protection, registry cleaning and startup management. Now let's see how we can download and install it. For that, let me quickly open my browser and here I'm going to type download CCleaner and there we go. Here we can see this first link belongs to CCleaner and here what we need to do is uh, we need to click on free download you will see the download process will automatically start if not then you can click here on download manually which will again forcefully start the downloading process after your CCleaner got downloaded it will look like this and the approximate size of CCleaner is 74 MB. Now to install double click on it and click on yes and then you will see this kind of interface. You also have option to customize it so let's click here on customize and now here it's up to us what we want to do. So if you want to create a desktop shortcut you can keep this checkbox enabled. I do not want it so I can disable it. The next option is to add CCleaner in start menu shortcut. So again I would say it is up to you whether you want to keep it there or not. Again I'm going to remove it. Then here it is also adding run CCleaner option to recycle bin so this option i'm gonna keep it checked then uh, remaining these options i'm going to keep them as it is now i'm going to click on install and there we go we have successfully installed ccleaner in our system before we move further i would ask you to consider subscribing to this channel as we keep on bringing these kind of productivity videos that are going to help you in your day-to-day -day life so make sure you subscribe to technoholic now let's come back to our topic and let's try to run ccleaner for first time so let's click here on run ccleaner and this actually have opened this website now this will comes like this and now here we can see the first option is health check you can scan your system by clicking on scan and then you know it is also asking to close my internet browser so i can actually close them and let's see what it speak about our system health and then here you can see the CCleaner also comes with Pro version and if you like it then you can also go with Pro version. And below here we can also see this PC spec which is 13700K, 64GB of RAM and RTX 4070. Despite this configuration is good, still my system may face health issues. And there we go, here we can see in terms of privacy it is making suggestion in terms of space also it is asking us to delete a lot of file and then we also have got this speed option and security option as well so if you want to use these options i think we need to go with the pro version but let's say you want to manage these things like a pro without any tool then i'm gonna add some of my videos that are going to help you to keep your system health in good shape you can check those videos out then um, we also have got this option which is custom clean performance optimizer which again i would say going to help our system performance up to date and there we go the performance scanner actually found 31 programs that are slowing down this PC. So what we can do is we can put all them in sleep mode at once or we can do that one by one. So simply we need to click on sleep. So in this way guys we will able to do that. And if you want to know which is the best alternative of CCleaner that comes from Microsoft itself and going to give you almost all software then please check the link in the description down below. And that's all guys from my side for this video. 
i hope you find this video helpful and informational if yes then hit that like button and subscribe to technoholic for more such tech tips and tutorial also leave a comment below if you have any questions or suggestion for future video and i will catch you soon in my next one till then you take care and bye bye